Hello, thank you for clicking the video. First, I just want to say that if you subscribe here, I will subscribe you back. Alright, so this is one of the reasons, uh, many reasons, why I don't want to use Pro, L Pro 12. I'm going to install Pro 11 to show you how good it is compared to 12. I don't know if I'm alone with this problem, but the uh, first problem I got was that I couldn't uh, undo, you know, with Control Z. But that was these fixes. Uh, restarted the program but that still that never happened to me in Pro 11 and well the second reason is this as you can see here I am stuck on 98% for some odd reason I tried cancelling it nothing happens I press the cross there in the top right corner still nothing happened so I had no choice but to end the process in you know, control alt delete but uh, of course it didn't save then uh, usually it saves you know when it crashes but uh, when you end the process it it doesn't say so uh, I just lost, uh, lost uh, like half an hour of work there uh, because uh, I've only got this autosave which for some odd reason isn't displayed in full resolution now uh, also I didn't find any difference between rendering with CPU and my CUDA I have a GTX 460 uh, factory overclock so I don't understand why uh, it shouldn't be faster because in Pro 11 I noticed a huge amount of speed increased uh, and I just you see I have it enabled here I've tried increasing but uh, there's no difference at all and uh, also the preview rendering is extremely slow as you see it's not it's not because I'm recording it's this slow otherwise also and Vegas Pro 11 it's lightning fast uh, because there it uses my CUDA in here for some reason it seems like it's not even though I've enabled it and everything yeah I don't think I have updated this but still you know it should work better than 11 because it's Pro 12 you know so just to show you I'm going to uninstall this and install Pro 11 again uh, so you can see uh, the difference in speed for me probably you with the same kind of gra graphic cards will have the same problems uh, so I recommend Pro 11 you'll see now why all right now so i've just installed vegas pro 11 and got rid of uh, 12 and as you see straight away there's no problem with the rendering and uh, all my menus and shit is back to normal also we'll try and uh, put some video effects here to see how um, great my cuda uh, is working <laughs> Alright, maybe it's not that great uh, when putting effects, but uh, still, uh, while not having effects, it's a lot better. Oh, maybe it's because I have full resolution. Yeah, that was why you see. Uh, now it's half resolution, just like it had the Linux Pro 12 when I showed you. There's no way at all, even using the effect. I'll try to put another effect as well. Still barely any lag, as you see. Just a little bit. So, yeah, those are the reasons uh, why I prefer Vegas Pro 11. Uh, and as I said earlier, maybe it's only me that got these issues. But thanks for wa watching, and uh, please subscribe me because I will subscribe you back. Uh, don't forget to like and comment, and please share this video. Oh, and if you're wondering how to uh, recover your lost f files, like I did, um, like that autosave I just got out, which was totally bugged out for some reason, you first off go into your local disk, go into users, go into your username, and up here you will find a hidden folder called app data. If you can't see that hidden folder, you need to go in here to tools press alt to enable these menus then go down here go to the middle tab there and tick show hidden fol files folders uh, and units I believe it should say in English and you just press ok then you should be able to find app data go to local Sony Vegas Pro 12 and well here you go they always uh, save here 
and just check the time try to find the most recent one and you should be able to recover your project but unfortunately this uh, retarded Pro 12 didn't save my project uh, so I lost quite uh, a lot of minutes of work there which is just a pain <laughs>